Hey there, how y'all doing? Welcome to uh, one of my soapbox videos. Um, in a few months since I did the last one of these, uh, I figure it's best to um, kind of chat in and talk about any kind of number of things. Um, originally, I wasn't going to be doing one of um, one of these kinds of videos, but um, over the weekend, I thought, uh, well, maybe uh, do some, uh, make some I like this quickly. Um, at first, I was feeling kind of down because I had just uh, put in an long day at my job and was um, feeling a little uninspired. Uh, I'm not sure, I'm looking for something to, nothing really so much to do or somewhere to go. So I figured, okay, I'll hop on the computer. And I went up on YouTube and got a notification about uh, there was an event that I saw courtesy of um, one of my top tier favorites on YouTube uh, in terms of reactor videos, uh, Popcorn in Bed. They held their annual Poppies Awards. And I had heard about it in the past, uh, but uh, I um, was unable to shine in to, uh, not shine in, what's the word, uh, you know, comment on their live stream. Um, I tuned into the live stream, watched the video. Uh, despite a few glitches in there, it was a really great show. And one of the cool things that I saw at the opening was it was an opening video about uh, introducing a lot of people who currently were YouTube reactors. And a number of faces that I had seen in this compilation uh, were from channels that I follow, channels like Ashley Burton, um, Asian BJ, um, so many, so many channels that I, I, I currently follow on YouTube made this short video as part of this compilation. And I thought, gee, I, this is where I wish where I was able to be a reactor, to be a part of that kind of a community of, you know, of people who do those kind of things to do these kind of videos. And it's just sadly that uh, that hasn't been the way it's been. And I was feeling down about that for a while. And then earlier today, um, just by happen chance, I tuned into another live stream. This time was for the channel for Ashley Burden. And something surprising happened during that uh, particular live stream, which um, I, I hadn't expected to see. Um, I tuned in, uh, it was already, she was already midway through it, not the way through it, it was only about a few minutes or so into the live stream. And then all of a sudden I hear, hi, Christopher. Hey, Christopher. And yeah, that, how'd the puppies go? I wasn't able to tune feel, in last night. Just made me feel recognized. And then I immediately, I commented because she had submitted a video for Popcorn in Bed for their their Poppies Awards. I asked him, I said, I saw you on the Poppies Awards last night. Uh, and she was intrigued by that. She loved the channel too. Uh, I also commented on her stream if they were going to be doing a collaboration with them. She said, yeah, sometime in April, it'll be great. It'll be interesting to see what kind of film these girls are going to be reacting to, which is really kind of fun. And I've been wanting to try to, to expand upon that to try to do like I said in my last videos, when I was doing the top 10 list, I said how oh, I really wanted to do the kind of things that these reactors do and to react to either music videos, react to movie trailers, react to TV shows, whether they be old or new, just to react, just to be part of the group. Uh, but unfortunately, I didn't know how to go about that. And also, if I did try to, and I, well, I have enough of an audience to uh, do it. So I try to find ways around that and if you've seen the types of videos that i have posted recently they've either been either doing reaction compilations from other people um i am surprised that people have been reacting to i'm getting so much reactions to my compilation for uh the ending scene from the film rush starring chris hemsworth i am surprised that people have been reacting to that and when people have been reacting to more of that um that makes me feel good. That makes me feel that, okay. There is a, an audience out there that likes what I do. Now I try to find to expand it and do other things. And I tried doing since I I couldn't do anything as far as posting anything with 
actual footage, I thought the next logical step would be um, with lip syncing. And I've done that a few times here. You may have seen some of my videos with, I've, I'm obscure with when it comes to topics. I did anything from Johnny Carson show to Jackie Gleason to the Benny Hill. I even did a try to do a thing for the Dead Poet Society. Uh, I've gotten a few views, but again, nothing really concrete. And then uh, just yesterday, uh, last night, um, inspired by seeing how, what kind of creativity people do for their stuff on YouTube, I thought, like, okay, let me try uh, to make um, a singing video like I did with my um, singing along to the Beatles now and then, which at that time had, you know, no thing, couldn't include anything as far as the actual video or music in the video, because again, it would get the copyright strike. Uh, so just as an experiment, I tried to do something with the classic tune of Scarborough Fair by Simon and Garfunkel. Uh, this is the version that was performed on television with Andy Williams, uh, for his 68 um, um, television special. If you've seen the video for that on here, it's an amazing rendition, just an acoustic version of just the three of them sitting down singing a song. And I thought, okay, let's try something here. Let's try record myself singing along to the video and then include the video as part of the performance. Synced it up together and came off okay, was synced up properly. And then just as an experiment, let me try to see if it would uh, pass the inspection on YouTube. Um, as far as would it pass, you know, uh, you know, copyright check and everything. And much to my surprise, it did. Uh, I didn't, unfortunately, I did not post it yet because I figured it had to have been some mistake. Um, I thought maybe, maybe I did something different. It wasn't, first of all, it wasn't a complete video. It was, I was, there still needed to be some more editing to be done with it. But I figured just to give it as a, as a test run to see if it would play uh, straight through without, you know, any stoppage or whatever, or any warning sign. And surprisingly, it passed the, the thing for the, the background checks as far as everything, as far as copyright was concerned. I thought like, let's, uh, let's not be uh, too hasty here. Then I realized when I was going through the um, choices uh, for the video, I clicked off where it says types of uh, license. One said standard YouTube license and the other said Creative Commons. Um, I didn't know what Creative Commons was. I didn't know if that's the thing that you needed to grant you the approval to use other forms of music inside the video, in your video. Um, if anybody out there who is watching this video, if they can comment down below uh, and say if that was the thing that you do, and I'm asking right now if the people who I do follow, who I've done my reactors list for, people like, you know, Ashley Burton, Gallifrey Gallus, Popcorn in Bed, um, is that what you do? Is that what you need to do here to uh, do the kind of things to do, to, to make those kind of videos that you all make? If that is the case, if that's what's needed to be done, boy, have I got a lot of ideas of what to create. If that's not what has to be done, then what are the steps to take? Do you need to get some kind of um, a license or approval from somewhere in order to use either footage from a film, footage from a TV show, um, a music video or a song, do you need to get the kind of a license to do these kind of videos? I'm still, I'm lost. I admit I'm a newbie, I am lost. I just need some, a little bit of help. And I'm afraid to ask uh, the people at YouTube, the YouTube creators uh, link if that's what you need to do. Um, because I just, I don't know, maybe just, I just don't want to sound foolish. Um, but just any little bit 
of information that that you can if people out there can throw in my way would be would be a really big help in terms of what I can create, what I would like to create, what I would like to present here on my channel. Um, any thoughts would be greatly appreciated. Um,